Hey Alex Malibur here, your friend in Furniture Sales. I wanted to make this video quite different today because I want to talk to you today about money. That's right. How much money did you leave on the table last week? How much money did you leave on the table last month? That's exactly what I want to do today. I want to make this video different because I want to have a real one-on-one -on -one conversation with you about your money, about your income, about your earning potential, right? Are you exploding your earning potential? Are you doing everything you can possibly do to increase your income every day? Or this is not your scenario. If this is not your scenario, this is the reason why I'm doing this video because I want to talk to you today about money. That's simple. You know, I wanted to take the time to make this video and actually pick a different topic instead of giving you techniques on how to close the deal, how to overcome a simple objection, or even how to greet a customer when they say, I'm just looking. I want to make this video different because I want you to be honest to yourself today and actually understand where do you stand when it comes to your income potential? Where do you stand when it comes to paying all your bills, right? So that being said, what I want to understand from you is actually how do you see this job? Do you see this just like a regular other job or do you actually see this as a career where you can actually make a lot of money? Well, what I can tell you is that I actually have been in the business for so many years and I had to understand that this is not a regular job anymore, right? I had to understand that this could actually become a great career where I can actually make a lot of money. And to tell you the truth, it has been. And I'm here to talk to you today about that. I'm here to change your perspective because if you're looking at this as a regular job where you don't have enough money to pay your bills, what I want you to understand is that there is a lot of earning potential when it comes to this career. But that being said, where do you stand? Are you in a position to understand that you can actually make a lot of money? Well, that being said, I want to I wanna talk to you today about what happened to me many, many years ago when I was starting on the furniture business. I had to understand one simple thing that helped me overcome every single obstacle that helped me uh, take my life to the next level and get a better lifestyle, right? And that is something very simple. I had to understand that other people were not going to pay my bills and that it was all about me. Everything that I could possibly do to increase my earning potential could be affected by my own decisions, right? So what I had to do is actually learn everything that I could learn about the business and be successful at it, right? I had to learn how to effectively greet a customer. I had to learn how to effectively overcome an objection, how to ask for the business at all times. But I had to take it upon myself because I knew that other people were not going to pay my bills. I knew that I wanted to see this as a career, but I had to understand that it was all about me, that I was the one that had to take my 120% every single day. I had to understand that I was the one that had to motivate myself instead of waiting for someone to tell me something to make me feel good. Instead of waiting for someone to tell me, go ahead and greet a customer. I had to understand that it was because of me that I was going to go to the next level. And that's my message to you. Where do you stand? Are you waiting for someone to, to tell you, hey, go ahead and greet a customer. Go ahead and turn this customer to you so you can get half a deal. Or are you actually doing everything you can possibly do every single day when you hit the floor to be able to close a deal? Are you working with another coworker to effectively turn over a customer and get a, and get a deal? Are you working with a manager to be able to role play scenarios on how to ask for the business? Are you doing everything that you can possibly do to be good at this game? Or are you just looking at this job as a regular other job where you're not going to make a lot of money? That's my message to you guys. My goal today is actually make you realize where do you stand? There is a lot of money to be made in this business. Yes, there is a lot of money to be made in this business, but it all starts with you. It all ends with you. You can come to me. You can come to your managers. You can come to any other person and look for advice. And what we're going to do at the end of the day is help you skill up, help you get better, help you overcome objections but we will never help you get the desire to be able to get better. That is all in you. It's on your own responsibility. If you have the desire to take your life to the next level by selling furniture, if you have the desire to make a lot more money on this business, it has to start with you. I'm not telling you to come work for me. I'm not telling you to go ahead and buy one of my products. What I'm telling you today is actually something that has worked for me that I had to understand that it was all within me to be able to make the decision to go all in. And that's my message to you. I want you to go all in. Don't just put your foot in the pool, jump on the pool, go all in 120% if you have to go 200% if you have to. But to the point that you start seeing this as a career, then you start making more money. Then you will be wondering what would have happened if I closed that deal? What would have happened if I turn over this customer to my coworker? You wouldn't be wondering that because you'll be closing more deals. 
but it all starts with you. You have to make it upon yourself to go the extra mile. That's my message to you today. Where is your money? How much money are you leaving on the table? Stop leaving money on the table every single week, every single month. It all starts with you. Go sell some furniture.